Welcome to our beauty, lifestyle, and fashion show. I'm your host, EJ Kimura. Now, let's dive into the latest buzz in the world of beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. These are the headlines. Our star to perform at Kenex Weekend Concert in Algeria. Ashake and Whiskey display bromance at Lunga Boy London Party. Sean Diddy Combs to be held without bail after sex trafficking and racketeering arrest. Ariana Grande's new Wicked Rem Beauty collection includes magical oil for the witches. And Rihanna rocks high fashion bathrobe at Fenty Hair Lunch in London. And on to our trending segments, a famous Nigerian singer, Ara Star, and South Africa's DJ, Maparosa, will be performing at the 2024 Creative Africa Nexus Weekend, Canex Weekend Concerts. This year's edition of the Canis Weekend will be held from October 16 to the 19, 2024 in Algiers, Algeria. Canis Weekend is a premier event showcasing Africa's creative and cultural industries. Our star gained global recognition after releasing her hit track, Bloody Samaritan, in 2021. You know what? Our star is really, really making a lot of waves, and I am so proud to be a Nigerian like her. Because, I mean, back in the days, women uh, artists was not really, really making any waves, and our star was able to use the opportunity that Mavis gave to her to be able to elevate Afrobeat. Like, I am so proud of her. Like, she's doing so much. And she's been on the news for so long, and she's been on the news doing a lot of good things, and I'm just so excited that she's able to grow and show us her growth in her music. Congratulations, our star. And on to our spotted segment, the UK witnessed a memorable moment in Nigerian music as Ashake and Whiskid displayed their bromance at the exclusive Lunga Boy party. The event saw Ashake host at the listening party for his recently released third studio album, Lunga Boy in London. Whiskid also features on the 13 track album on a track titled MMS, was also present at the event. Together, Ashake and Whiskey were the center of attention as they were spotted enjoying each other's company throughout the night. You know what, guys? I love this. I love when I see two collaborations from two great artists. I mean, Ashake just blew, maybe like 2017, and Whiskey is the GOAT in the industry. So I'm so excited to see Whiskey, you know, party with him, hang out. You know, Whiskey don't like nobody, <laughs> my opinion. Whiskey really doesn't really, really deal with a lot of people. So for him to be here supporting Ashake, I am so happy to see this. We Whiskey fans, we are so happy to see this collaboration and I, this is actually one of my favorite song on the album also with the one with Travis Scott so congratulations Ashake congratulations Whiskid and on to our editorial segment Sean Diddy Combs was now granted bond following his bombshell arrest a George order that the embattled rapper turned mogul be held without bail pending trial in his ongoing sex trafficking a judge ordered that the embattled rapper turned mogul to be held without bail pending trial in his ongoing sex trafficking case in federal court. Prosecutors claim that Combs abused, threatened, and coerced women and others around him to fulfill his sexual desires, protect his reputation, and conceal his conduct for decades. Despite the shocking allegations, Combs' attorney and he and his client were disappointed with the U.S. Attorney's Office for pursuing an unjust prosecution. You know what? I am so disappointed in P. Diddy, Sean Diddy Cole. Like a lot of a lot of, of our of our greatest people in the industry that was the big, big, big people in the industry. Do you guys realize that all their legacy has been destroyed? Like you build a legacy so big and for it to end this way. Like I'm so disappointed in Diddy. When I saw that video with him harassing, abusing Cassie, I was so disappointed in him. Um, Diddy, you have three girls, you have kids and I don't know what your kids are probably thinking. I did see them walking, trying to support you for your uh, um, your hearing, bail hearing. And I'm kind of happy that they kind of told you, no, you cannot come on, come out on bail. Um, you had your mom, you had your aunties, you had your baby mama. They all signed so you can get this bail granted. But the judge was like, no, we're not going to grant you this bail because what you did is so horrible. And you guys know that P. Diddy has been linked to the death of Tupac and also Biggie Small. So... As you say, what goes around comes around and karma always comes back. So I don't know if this is Didi's disappearance or Didi's end. I don't know what to say, but we're so disappointed in you, P. Didi. We looked up to you. A lot of people in the industry looked up to you. And I feel like this is such a horrible way to go out. They did it to Bill Cosby. They did it to R. Kelly. And now the greatest of them all, P. Didi. Well, good luck, Didi. I don't know what else to say. I'm just not really, really happy with what you've done. On to our new collection. Ariana Grande's new Wicked Inspired collection of makeup for her Ram Beauty line will be available October the 1st. 
She said it was heavily inspired, not just by the movie, but by the stage show and the Wizard of Oz books and includes a magical twist. One item in the nine piece collection is a pH adaptive lip oil that changes colors, depending on the wearer. The other items include eyeshadow, metallic matte lipstick, and lip stains, inspired by the tulip fields of Oz. And all the colors have names that are very specifically and wickedly Ariana mentioned in an interview. You know what, Ariana? I don't know about this whole witch line. I don't know, maybe because Halloween is coming. I have no idea, but I would love to try that lip oil. I do know that it went viral on TikTok, but everybody that I've been seeing using the lip oil has been Caucasian, not of the black skin. So maybe I would lo love to try it and see what actual color comes out from my lips. So I don't know. I'm gonna go check it out, Ariana. Good luck. On to our spicy or not. Rihanna celebrated the launch of her Fenty hairline at Selfridge in London in style, choosing a statement making wrap dress that has resembled a fuzzy bathrobe. The bad gal showed out in a custom Jacquees look made from a recycled feathers and inspired by the brand La Casa collection per a press release. It is a version of the brand's Caruso coat, which features exaggerated levels and a removable belt. The diamond singer showed up a bit of a leg with a look thigh high slit and paired the bold dress with gold pointed toe Amina Model heels. You guys, I saw this look and I was like, Rihanna can never go wrong. Like Rihanna can wear a trash bag for goodness sake and look so good. She looked like a million bucks. And when I saw this look, it's a robe that you just wear at home. A fuzzy basic robe that Rihanna just put on, tied it to the side and showing a little skin with the cutest little nude heels. Like Rihanna, you can do no wrong. And she's lost so much weight, you guys. Like Rihanna, you look so good. And I wonder if you, who styles her? I'm sure she has, she styles herself. Or if somebody wants to style her, I'm sure that she also adds her impute. But Rihanna, you look amazing. And I love, love, love this. I'm gonna try and recreate this look someday. Okay, Rihanna? <laughs> And don't forget to catch us up at Spice TV underscore Africa on all social media platforms. Until I come your way next time, you guys, have a lovely day. Bye.